hi guys welcome to my weekend reading vlog it's saturday morning here and i think it's like 10 a.m or past 10 a.m i just woke up there's this dog that has been barking over and over again this is actually my first reading vlog so i'm excited about this one because i don't know what on earth i'm doing so it might be a messy one but just bear with me i'm half asleep last week was really 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 crazy and i'm just happy for the weekend to be here so i can just relax and be taken care of i'm going to do some reading this weekend and just rest hopefully so i'm rounding up with the mechanics of yenegoa by michael afenfia and that book is so interesting and then this weekend i'm going to go to some chimeka garricks tomorrow died yesterday and a broken people's playlist so normally i would say i'm not a morning person but then after reading atomic habits james clear is like you can't work on waking up early and trying to do things early and developing and building good habits on waking up early without getting rid of the what does he call it like self-limiting beliefs and words that you tell yourself oh i'm not a morning person i'm going to let you guys know how it goes over the course of the weekend most of the time i actually really just read on my bed so i'm going to be reading on my bed because i may actually fall asleep at this point i'm so tired <laughs> so if i fall asleep well i mean there's that but if i don't it's fine <laughs> made reference to insecure this series and i feel like i'm the only one who hasn't watched insecure so on this note like i need to go and watch it like if these people are talking about it then why on earth have i not watched this series anyway whatever <music> oh my gosh wait i even have to like go back this is just too crazy like what you know what like funny enough actually when this book was getting to the end <laughs> so i was on page 300 for those of you that are going to read it i'm not even going to give any spoilers the book ended at 303 I was on 300 of this book right and then it was ending a particular way like the writing was going and I'm like oh, okay this is a predictable ending yeah maybe I might be okay for something good and then I just took one paragraph to change everything and I'm like this book is so like what I had a good laugh, I had a good gasp, I had everything that I would probably want in a book. Yeah, so it's like 2.40 now, or so 2.40 p.m. And I guess the reason why I took so long to finish this book was because I've been on my social media. My baby, and, my, and by my baby, I mean my nephew just had his first haircut. So... I've been like gushing all over all the photos and the videos and I can't keep calm 
I've just been all over the place. I'm going to go and look for something to eat now because it's almost three o'clock and I haven't had anything today. And I'm starving. And I didn't want to have anything until I made sure that I finished this book. So what am I reading next right now? Oh my goodness. Let me show you guys what the, my, like a part of my room looks like, literally. I, I had to move. There's always so many books around my room. Like I have books on my bed, on my table, on my bedside table. I have books everywhere. So these are some of the books that I plan to read this month, which you guys saw in my June TBR that was like really crazy. These are some of the copies of Tomorrow Died Yesterday that my book club won at the giveaway that we did. So these are my copies and these are the two books that i'm going to read i'm reading tomorrow died yesterday and a broken people's playlist by both by chimeka garrix so we chose this book tomorrow died yesterday we chose it for a uh, book of the month for june yes yeah, so we're going to discuss it july 4th and some of the people on the book uh club whatsapp group have already started talking about how amazing it is so i can't wait to get into it so those two books are my weekend reads i don't know if obviously i'll be able to finish it this weekend okay so update i just got my knitting pins delivered to me woo, woo. that's supposed to be my excited dance yeah i decided to take up knitting again i don't think i've knitted in close to 10 years but there was a time where i used to knit a lot and i really really enjoyed it so i'll show you my knitting pins that i got i just got these pins delivered i got like different sizes from I think their name is Crafties or something like that. Um, I think I even probably have to watch a video on how to knit again. I had gotten my yarns before. So, yeah. Some really soft, nice yarns that I had gotten. So I'm really excited about that. Um, but just make sure that it's closed up on the needle. So this first loop is actually going to be the first stitch on our project. And the number of stitches that we put on this first needle is going to determine the width of whatever it is you're knitting. So a scarf that's going to be about this wide, and yeah. just go out from there. <laughs> and these this brings back so many memories. Are pretty short just because they're easy to maneuver for me for the video. But most knitting needles are going to give you a lot of space to create a pretty large project. So it's Sunday morning. I think it's like 9.30. No, past 10. I, I wanted to do a video yesterday evening, but then I think I fell asleep. No, I didn't. I was just too lazy. No, I was addicted to knitting. Yes, I think I was up, a little obsessed with knitting. So I'm going to show you <laughs> the progress of my knitting so far. Oh, and it matches what I'm wearing. I don't know whether it's going to be like a shawl or something, but I'm not sure yet. I have a couple of videos to shoot, so I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to take some pictures and then I'm just going to chill. That's kind of what I have to do today. I'll come back when I'm about to shoot. Oh God, I don't know who that is. I think I opened my windows, yeah, to get some fresh air so now I can literally hear everything everybody's saying. So, hi guys, so I'm back. I just obviously got ready. I look like a million dollars. I just got done with listening to online service and I'm going to start shooting in a bit. So, I'll see y'all later. I just finished filming for Atomic Habits. I had a blast. <laughs> talking about that book so now i'm going to change i'm going to film for um the mechanics of yenegoa so i typically film like four to six videos at once and then before then let me show you guys i have a book that has like a script of 
what i'm going to talk about oh that's my tripod by the way and then that's my bookshelf which you guys always see so i just put my phone on the tripod and then i'm going to show you like my script book of what i my pointers of things that i jot down when i am reading a book and i want to speak about it on my book review today is an amazing day for filming the natural light is amazing you guys see this is where my natural light comes in from i try not to pull up the blinds a lot because um i don't want the light to be too much on me but the natural light is good i also have light in my room thankfully and I have the air conditioning on because I sweat a lot so yeah and then I just sit down behind there this is my script like I said um, I'm going to be talking okay I just finished atomic habits review and this is basically everything that I said as you guys can see I have a conclusion I always have an intro where I put the logo the welcome um, my notes and stuff like that um yeah so i'm going to shoot the mechanics of yenegoa i also have some ideas for my thumbnail and this is basically like my ideas book of all the things that i write down as you guys can see this was when i first started in january and i was doing a lot of research and the things that i've learned when i get to 500 subscribers you guys i'm going to show you <laughs> some of these things behind the scenes that really helped me you know i also try to plan my scheduling this was of women and frogs this was you guys have watched these videos the four agreements i tried to have a shooting schedule of things that i want to shoot and then i have like some ideas anytime i think of something i write it down this was for you are a badass i'm sure you guys have watched the review on that this was for my reading routine when i put cards and i tried to do other things it's it's quite <laughs> A lot you guys that goes into this even if I try to make it look like I'm just talking from the top of my head what was this one for this was for rape culture in Nigeria where I put down some notes and stuff like that and then at the back <laughs> I typically have a reading schedule but clearly for June <laughs> <laughs> I've really not finished. I finished Atomic Habits. The, the dates just keep on getting jumbled up. Obviously, this one I had to start again from the beginning. This one, man, it was just this was posting schedule actually, and it was just a whole whatever. And then this is how I keep track of the books that I've read so far. So I've shown you guys a little bit of the behind the scenes of what goes into all of this. So I'm going to shoot for the mechanics of Yonego. I'm looking like a sweet girl. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna stop now. So I'll see you guys later when I'm done. Bye. This book was such a funny and entertaining read for me. Okay, this is... Hello, good people. <laughs> so I just finished recording for the mechanics of Yonego. It's... 12 30 here and i'm doing good so far if i do say so myself so i'm about to shoot the next video which is and i've changed my shirt as you can see the mid-year freak out tag where i would like discuss the books that i've read so far and you know it asks some questions about the books i've read so far my reading progress and what i want to read like next half of the year so it's like a mid-year sort of stock whatever for book lovers okay before i go let me show you i actually oh i look so pretty <laughs> i actually wrote down the answers on my laptop so i'm going to show you briefly what it looks like before i get into filming okay so you're definitely going to see these answers stay tuned and i'll let you know how it goes peace uh hi guys so i'm back again i just finished recording for oh which one oh yeah media <laughs> freak out tag. i'm, I'm media freak out tag i'm already getting tired it's to one i've been shooting for the past one hour one and a half hours and i'm literally getting tired i'm on my last straw i'm about to shoot a video for law school students in nigeria a reading video on basically how to prepare for the bar finals and i will share my story and give some tips on not you see well i mean so there's the 
mosque which is not far away that they're literally praying and have interrupted my video so there's that as i was saying i'm going to record like some sort of reading tip for law school students i know how crazy it is when you're reading for nigerian law school bar finals and i don't think they're about to go in for exams just yet but at least the video will be there and anytime they want to watch it they can always go back i'm just going to give tips on how to read and prepare so not necessarily like what to read but just in reading how to read and prepare for that so let's see how that video um goes so i'll come back when i'm done this is the last video i'm going to shoot today i'm literally already tired of shooting it takes a lot of energy from me and i will be done so that at least i can have content for the next week for you guys so i will see you much later bye this point i'm done with the law school video i am mad exhausted i need to it's like quarter to two i need to look for something to eat i am just so tired oh yeah i said i was going to show you my knitting progress i was up till 3 a.m knitting i don't even know what's wrong with me i was up till 3 a.m no till 2 a.m <laughs> i was up till 2 a.m knitting and this is what the progress looks like Whoop, whoop. i don't know what i'm knitting yet but i'll let you guys know soon so i've come to the end of my weekend reading vlog i don't even know how to do the whole evening thing. look at this point i'm just tired <laughs> i don't know how people who do vlogs do it like it's just really crazy and i don't know if i'll be doing anyone anytime soon so you guys should let me know whether you liked this or you enjoyed it or if i should continue doing stuff like this and i will see you in my next video when i'm not so tired bye